How's it going, y'all? Maybe soon here. Today, we're going over pistol lights. The light that you see on this PSA dagger here is the Warriorland MA2 crossbow. It is kind of a direct competitor to the TLR7 from Streamlight. In fact, the form factor is pretty dang close. It, actually, I can put this crossbow on my PDP and throw it into my holster for my PDP that is for TLR7 and it works great. So, this company reached out to me, Warrior Land, and asked if I wanted to try out this light and the holster combo that comes with it, which the holster is here. It only comes, the combo and light holster only come together as a right-handed version, so I can't conceal carry with it. However, I did use it for like an outside the waistband holster when I was testing it, and it was pretty nice. The light itself has pads here. It's kind of like the O-Light activation where you press in to the side there. It has a way to charge it um, via a magnetic charging and you plug it into the wall. The battery does not come out of it. It is internal to the light. Um, when you do turn it on, it has 800 lumens and then it goes down to, mine said 500, the instruction says 300, but mine said went down to 500 when it got under, uh, down to like two, so I'll show you here in a sec, when it got down to two bars of battery and it went down to 500 lumens. You can also have a five lumen output version uh, with a double press of the paddles here. So that's pretty nice. And when you do turn it on, when you turn it on, it shows you how much power you have here. It says how many lumens, which is 800, and it says Warrior Land. So that's really nice that you can tell how much is power is left on this and you don't have to worry about anything until you get pretty low, which, I mean, you should be changing your batteries out and say your TLR7 more often than not. You need to check it, make sure that it's good, but this at least has a way to tell you what you have on and off. Now the combo comes in this box here, which is pretty nice. It's a really nice packaging for the combo, the light, and the holster. And the foam here holds everything pretty nice when you get it. it comes with a bag with extra adapters. It comes with a bag with extra adapters for whatever uh, handgun you want to use. But like I said, this is specifically for the Glock 19. Uh, well, actually, I didn't say that. This holster is specifically for the Glock 19, and that way my dagger fits into it. They have other options for the combo, but mine is with the Glock 19. Now, when you open up the instruction manual, it tells you here what each little piece, what each adapter is used for, for what firearm it can be used for. So that's really nice. A lot of other places don't really say. You have to either go on their website or it kind of says it on the pieces, but not really. And it has a breakdown of what all the different things have to say on the viewing window to tell you what it is. And then here it says it can last up to about an hour, hour and a quarter here. Once it drops down, you, uh, once it drops down to a certain amount, it goes from 800 to 500. This says 800 to 300, but mine, it drops down from 800 to 500 lumens. I do not know what the Candela is. The Candela is not said on their website, but I mean, it's a handgun pistol. It doesn't need to reach out 300 meters or 300 yards to identify. It needs to identify what's close to you if something's coming after you in the night. I'm gonna roll in a video right here that uh, shows you down my a hallway in my house. Uh, I couldn't film outside the last few days at night because it's been really freaking windy. So here's that video. This is my hallway on the other side of my house. It's about 20 feet long. I have a doorway at the end and a doorway to my living room on the left and my guest bedroom on the right. And this is with the five lumens. It's very light. 
but you can still see. Now I'm gonna do it with the 8,000 lumens. Boom, really bright. You'd be able to tell whatever the hell is down that hallway. Now, some people want to complain that this is a Chinese company. What I say to that is stop using your phone, stop using your car, stop using your clothing, most of your clothing, stop using your appliances because everything has stuff that is made in China if it's not just completely made in China. So you need to get over the fact that it is Chinese made because you have a lot of stuff that is Chinese made on you, in your house, that you're using. Actually, if you are on your phone right now, completely made in China. However, the company, the people that I worked with there are very nice. They sent this out for me to check out and I really like it. It is a budget option for something like the TLR7 and it is great. I really like it. And if you have any questions about it, hit me down in the comments below. I'll let you know what other, what I'll try and answer your questions or not. If not, uh, there should be a link down below to their website and yeah, go check out this light. I really like it.